they're saying this is the most fortified structure in the history of fortified structures. They can't use their superpowers, and we have less than 14 hours to steal the thing. And none of us are master thieves. Master thieves. No. No, we're not. Master thieves. He's awesome. Hello, Flash. It out, or I'm gonna step onto that ship and pretend like this conversation never happened. Iris, boy, girlfriend, fiance, Mazel Tov. What about it? If you don't help me, she's gonna die. True love. That's your pitch. That's all I've got. And I assume saving your girlfriend requires us doing something less than lawful. We need to break into Argus and steal an alien power source. Flash, thief. It's my kind of mission. One condition. My rules. It's as valuable as you say it is, and the deepest recesses of any facility are usually the most secure. Mm. Smart, snart. <laughs> Smart, snart. I'm gonna keep hacking away and find out for sure. Do you have, uh, any idea what else might be down there? Doesn't matter. There are only four rules you need to remember. Make the plan, execute the plan, expect the plan to go off the rails, throw away the plan. No, I need you to take Iris to some place far away from here. Far away from me. Harry. I can't know where. If I know, then Sabotar knows. Okay, Wally. We'll keep her safe. Don't worry. Oh, or two. Hello. We need your help. I have 
the energy source. The snarf's trapped inside the cell, but King Shark, you gotta open the door. I can't hack it in the mainframe. Hurry, all right? Cisco's working on it. Whatever you do, don't look behind you. Cisco saves my life, tell him how in the good word with my sister. Come on. Avatar in his own game. Your goodness is your strength. Call me sentimental. Keep the flash and remain a hero. Take care of yourself, sir. Adam. No strings on me. Hi. Nothing important begins. We got the dominant attack. Yes. Yes. Where's Iris? Uh, Iris, safely stashed away on Earth 2 with all Harry Wells. Oh, no. She... Oh, no. 
don't need the merch. No, 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 no. Too soon to say. Almost like the comics. Is it getting bigger? Tearing out that just sucked. <sighs> that was, I don't know what was more sadder when Henry Ellen died or when Iris died. I'd have to say when Iris died tonight, I think that really, this was truly the most saddest episode ever. They failed, or supposedly they failed. So, so, so the positive sense is that I'm really, I really like seeing smart snart and the fact that there is a mutual respect in a sense for the, for, for Barry and snart. And it reminds me again of out of time at that last, that one storyline where future flash goes back in time. And then he's with captain cold on his deathbed. And he said, you know, I wasn't there for you. And he actually stayed with Captain Cold. So that kind of mutual respect, it reminded me of that. Oh, so um, I remember that. That was cool. And the King Shark thing, that was that was pretty funny. And it was pretty scary. Seeing Jaws, you know, through the um, through the steam, not the steam, but but through the, um, the clouds and the mist. So that was pretty cool. It was cool seeing, cool seeing Lila in Argus. Um, I'm just really sad. I, it's hard for me to, it's hard for me to, to kind of pick up with the whole episode of what happened in this episode. I was really happy to see Harrison Wells in this episode and then Future Barry tricked them. So that's where HR feels like he failed the group. So everything came to pass as what was shown. And now I'm wondering, okay, so then Wally, did Wally still become paralyzed? That must have happened. It's really, really hard to, I don't know. I don't think I can say much with this episode. This episode pretty much spoke for itself. I don't, I'm wondering with the season finale, then what will happen? How will this episode end? Will there be a form of redemption? Will the speed force see Iris as an angel and return her back to Barry? What would Barry do? Where does Barry go from here? We don't know what's going to happen. And then Tracy Branch, she, this truly affects her because her machine didn't work and it's because the Philosopher's Stone or the Sorcerer's Stone. Philosopher's Stone? I can't remember. But the stone counters all that. So that's where the stone then comes into play. Man, I am truly bummed. I'm truly bummed right now. Don't have much to say about this episode. Um, 
I've seen pictures, there's a funeral, but I could have sworn we saw Iris's, I could have sworn we saw Iris, but then, wait a minute, I saw in the pictures of, of next week, there is a, there is, um, I saw in the picture of next week that Jake Garrett is out of the speed force, so then that's a good thing, so, in anything, Barry, Barry, I think, goes into the speed, this is my prediction, I think Barry goes into the speed force, Fights future Barry in the Speed Force or something, and and then Jay Garrett comes out. Maybe then Barry has to make some sort of arrangement with the Speed Force to save Iris. I, I don't know. Oh, <laughs> so this is Jocelyn. This is the most saddest reaction video I've ever done. And so say la vie, say la vie. Subscribe, like. I'm I'm. Got nothing else. I think HR sacrificed himself. I think that's what happened. I think he felt... S well, wait a minute. How could that have happened? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Because I was thinking, here's my thought at first, but then it's not going to make any sense. So, so here's my thought. Is that, okay, at first I was thinking HR sacrificed himself. He used that thing to disguise his face this whole time. And, um, and so he was Iris. But then my thought is, well, Savitar had Iris this whole time, so it couldn't have been HR. 